Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So, if you saw on my Instagram, you will already know what this video is going to be. And it's going to be my vinyl collection, part two. So, a month ago, I filmed part one, which was all the um, small vinyls. And I said then that I was going to add in the, the bigger ones. I never did that. Because I was waiting for my MacBook to come, which I now have so I can edit properly. I didn't have a tripod, which I do now, because my camera is stood, even if it's slightly cockeyed, which I think it is. Um, I will sort all this, by the way, guys. You know, I am new to this whole tripod thing, but literally, my phone right now that I'm using as a camera is propped up on a tripod. And I can walk around and hold it. That's filming so much easier. It certainly adds to the perks of being a YouTuber. Anyway, I'm rambling. Point is, I was waiting for my MacBook, which I now have, and I was waiting for a tripod, which I now have, and I was waiting for one vinyl in particular that I didn't know if I was going to get for my birthday or Christmas. Turns out if you saw my birthday haul, you will already know that I got it for my birthday. Um, so that's why this is a month late. But... I am gonna do it right now, guys. And yeah. Hello to my sister who I. Oops. Hey. Hey. Sorry about that, guys. My sister just came in. <laughs> she didn't realise I was filming. Um. Anyway, I'm gonna get my vinyls. I'm gonna be right back. And yeah, I'll see you guys in a minute. And I'm back. And luckily, you can't see, but there are vinyls here. Not all of them. I'm going to do it in small piles because otherwise it's just too much. And I do not have a big bedroom. So, the first vinyl I'm going to show you is Little Mix Between Us. So, if you saw my birthday haul, you know I got this for my birthday. And I literally just opened it off camera like five minutes ago. So, I have the rubbish down here which you don't need to see it is on black pressing so i'm not going to show that but what i didn't know was that my mom had got me a signed vinyl wait look at that they have signed that like Oh my god. So that was a nice surprise because <laughs> I didn't know. I didn't know it was signed. So yeah. And it is a double, uh, it's a gate bold. So when you open it up, it looks like that. Uh, and there's the track list on the back if you guys can see that. I think you can. Right, I will take one of the sleeves out. I'll take out the one that doesn't, that isn't linked to the, the signed thing. Just to show you guys, this is what the sleeve looks like. And it is standard black vinyl, which is perfectly okay. I, I do not have a problem with it. I love all vinyls. Right, so I'm just going to pop that underneath. So the next one I have is... When Facing the Times We Turn Away From, which is the solo project done by Luke Hemmings from Five Sauce. Which I don't know, I don't think I ever actually said when I got this. I basically, I pre-ordered this off of his uh, merch site. And I have the CD as well, but the CD thing came cracked. So that's always fun. So there's the slip case, it's just got a picture of him on it. And, ooh... It is printed on blue vinyl. I don't know if you guys can. There we go. That's really cool. So yeah, I might um might buy another one of them, given how mine came cracked. I don't actually know where to put these. I'll put them over there. All right. The next one is. 
Super Bloom, A Live Experience by Ashton Irwin. Again, this is his solo project that he did. And this is also a gatefold. It's not really that interesting. It just says Super Bloom on it. And this isn't two vinyls, it's just one. However, it is. Oh, there's the there's the sleeve. Which is the exactly the same as the gatefold, just in case you couldn't see that. And then it's printed on red vinyl if the camera will focus. There you go. Looks orange on camera, but in real life it's red. So ready orange. Guess it depends on how you look at it. Right, now oh, can't get it back in. Here we go. Right. So this next one was a Record Store Day exclusive for this year. It is just Confetti by Little Mix, which I'm pretty sure I have on vinyl. Like another version of this, or maybe maybe I don't. I don't know. There's the slip cover. Just got them on it. And it is printed on hot pink vinyl. It, it looks red on camera. The camera is not doing this justice at all, but it is bright pink. That camera's not comes focusing on me. You can't see that, but it is bright pink. And I can't get it back in. There you go. But yes, this was a record store day exclusive for this year, which I love record store day. I just, I just do, because I buy some really cool records, albeit some of them I have to get online, but it's by the by. So the next one we have is Why Don't We, uh, I can't remember what this one's, ah, oh, The Good Times and the Bad Ones, I can't remember what this album was called. So it is a gatefold, and it just has them on it, and I'm pretty sure this is two, two and one, yeah it is, it's two and one. So I'll just show you one of them, because, oh my god, I can't get it out. And there's nothing in that one. Oh, there is. There is, there's the booklet and poster. Okay, so it's not two vinyls, it's one, I just can't get it out. There we go. That was tough. Okay, so this is the sleeve it's honestly not that interesting it is printed so what's off their website it's on clear vinyl so they had an exclusive um limited edition clear vinyl or a standard black vinyl and obviously i wanted the limited edition one that's <laughs> the clear one obviously there we go So the next one I have is Shawn Mendes Wonder, which is a gatefold, which just looks like that. And I think that's a poster, I think. I don't actually know because I've no Okay, it is a poster. Yep, that that is a poster. As you can see, that is a poster. I'm not going to unfold it because it will be too big for the gap that I have, which isn't very big. Right, so I'm going to slot that back in. And I'm going to pull the vinyl out. So this is the um, sleeve thing. It's not that interesting. It's just got lyrics on. And it is again printed on a clear vinyl. If you guys can see that, it looks blue on cut. There we go. And yeah, I think I'm pretty sure I got this off his website. I'm pretty sure I did. I usually do. All right. So the next one I have is Super Bloom by Ashton Irwin. Um, again, this is another gatefold, and this gatefold's really cool. It says AI, and it's got a lot of, um, like, doodles, if you guys can see that. Alright, 
that and i'm pretty sure this is two vinyls nope that looks like a but i always think it's number two vinyls it's never is. right if you couldn't see the um inside of the gatefold this is basically what it looks like it's just a load of doodles on it and it is printed because i got this off of this website on lime green vinyl i mean that's pretty cool i don't know if it glows in the dark I don't think it does. If you guys know if this com if this vinyl um glows in the dark, comment down below and let me know. Okay, so it does not go in there. It goes in there. Oops. There we go. Right, I'm just gonna leave that there. So next we have Little Mix Confetti. So the other one that I showed you before was a record store day exclusive. This is just the normal pressing of the vinyl it does have scratches on it i am aware of that oh wow i've forgotten how cool this was so this has got like it's a clear splatter vinyl but the splatters look like bits of confetti on them oh that's so cool and these sleeve just has lyrics on it from different songs from their album and this is just a single um single vinyl it's not like the record store day where it was a gatefold so next we have cherry blossom by the vamps it just looks like that and this is also not a gatefold it's just one vinyl and this is what the sleeve looks like it's just got them on one side and credits on the other side and it was just printed on black vinyl. But that's okay, because I love the vamps anyway. And I'm really hoping that they release new music next year, 2022. And I can't get this back in. There we go. Alright, next we have Five Seconds of Summer Calm. Which as you can see is a picture, so I've got the Ashton one. So it's got Ashton on one side and five cells on the other. I've just realised I got two. Never mind. So I got the I'll put that one back. So I got the Ashton one, which has Ashton on that side and all of them on that side, and it has um, Red Desert Remix on this side and side B, I don't know what it has on it. it doesn't actually say what it has on, on side B. It, it doesn't say. So I got the Ashton one and then I forgot I got the Luke version which has Best Years Luke Remix Edition and again, the other side's the same I tried to get the other two but they sold out so can't get them so the next one we have is Heartbreak Weather by Mr Niall Horan and this is not a gatefold but it does have it does have a book in it as well so that's, no, maybe they're pic they might be pictures yeah, they're pictures. Okay, I don't want them. Right, I bought this off his website, that's why I've got pictures. And this one is printed... Oh, there's the sleeve, it's not that interesting. It's printed on light blue of the camera will focus. I can't really see that. It looks really dark on camera, but it's a lot lighter in real life. I can't get it back in. There we go. So next, and I am, by the way, I am nearly done with this pile. And I don't know if you can see over there, there are quite a few more. So, but hopefully it won't take me as long because I'm doing it in sections. Anyway, next we have Walls by Louis Tomlinson. 
and again this is not a gatefold i think this is just standard black yeah it is there's the flip cover it's just got pictures of him on it and lyrics on the other side can't really see that and then it is just printed on black vinyl So let me go back in. There we go. So I have two more. No, three more. Three more for this pile, and then I'll go and get some more. So the next one I have is Calm by Five Seconds of Summer. Again, not a gatefold, but really cool either way. There's the sleeve. It has them. On it all blurred that's the front and the back and i don't remember oh yes i do okay the sleeve's actually broken i don't know if you guys can see that i think it came like that it is printed on light pink but the camera is not doing it justice it's just focusing on me so it's making it look like it's the same color pink here but it's not so well it's it might be the same, it might just be my camera that's just not showing up the colours properly. Right, and then we have New Hope Club, their self titled album. This is what the sleeve looks like it has them on one side and lyrics on the other. And this is again just standard black vinyl. Sorry guys, I don't know why I'm rushing this last bit. And the last one for this section is Louis Tomlinson Walls. It is a picture disc that was limited edition on his website. So it just has it's just this on one side. I don't know if it's like that on the other side because I've never opened it, as you can see. So, that was it for the first pile. I'm going to be right back with another pile. I'll see you guys in a minute. And I'm back. <sighs> and I manage, I'm actually quite proud of myself because I managed to do this second half all in one pile so I don't have to do a third half um but there are a lot more here as you can see because they are here um so this section might be longer <laughs> than the first one but we'll have to see okay so the next vinyl I have if it will let go is Shawn Mendes MTV Unplugged which is a live um live album that he did i have it on cd as well and i have it on vinyl it is damaged i can't know if you guys can see that just there no you can't see that because the camera's not there you go no all right you can't see it but it's um i bought this off amazon and it came damaged so that's really annoying this is a gatefold so it just has a picture of him performing with lyrics on the other side. I'm pretty sure this is just black vinyl. I pull out the one that's. Ugh. I thought it would be easier to pull out, and it wasn't. So there's the the sleeve. It's just a plain white one, and it is just on standard black. And just to clarify, yes, I do have a record player. It's down here. I'm not gonna, not gonna pull it out because it's got stuff on top of it. But it is a red uh, record player. I got it for Christmas a few years ago. About five, four years ago. Oh God, there we go. All right, so that's the first one. Then the next vinyl I have is Liam Payne. LP1 picture disc so it looks like that on one side and that on the other 
it's just a chart listing and this was um limited on his website so i was very lucky to get one by the way most of these vinyls i did buy with my or have bought over the years with my own money um some of them my mum has bought for me but the vast majority i have bought myself i just want to put that out there so the next one is harry styles fine line and this is a gatefold and this one's actually really heavy okay that was a surprise um so it comes with this which i'm pretty sure is a post don't i'm just gonna stick it over there this is the gatefold whoops Oh, it's so heavy right and i'm just gonna show one so it's just got lyrics on it and it's printed on light green vinyl it looks clear on camera but it's like a, a pale green right i'm not sure why this isn't inside one of the sleeves because it will probably fit if I can there we go right then the next one is why don't we eight letters this again I bought off their website, so it is a limited pressing. At least I'm pretty sure it was. And it is again, it's not a clear, but I was going to say it's a clear one, it's not clear. It is a white vinyl. And the sleeve just has lyrics on them, along with my fingerprints. Nice. There we go. <clears throat> I am trying to not make this video too long guys, but I tend to ramble, so I don't think there's a high chance of it of this video not being long, given how long my CD collection was. Right, the next one is Liam Payne LP1. This is just the um the non-picture disc version. So the sleeve just has lyrics on which you can't really see. And it is printed on a clear vinyl, like that. Oh, and it has a, a code in there as well to get a free um, free download of the album. But I don't need the free download. So then we have a limited edition um, picture disc vinyl. Again, it's Little Mix Bounce Back when they released it as a single. There was picture discs of all the girls, so I got the jade one. Really pretty. I don't know what it looks like on the other side because I have never opened it. That's what the back looks like. I don't know what the other side of the final looks like. So yeah, and then the next one is Shawn Mendes Illuminate. Which is, and sleeve is just in one of these things and it's printed on black vinyl i'm pretty sure there was one i don't know where this was or maybe I'm, i don't know if i'm making this up or not but i think there was one copy of illuminate on vinyl that was like a bright like the color green that he used for this era comment down below let me know if i'm right chances are i'm probably not right i want to make sure it goes in the right way there we go. Okay, so next we have Fab Sauce Live, which I, it was only on their website for a short amount of time and I bought it. And it is actually two vinyls. They've just not done it in a gatefold for some reason. So that's what, that's what one of the sleeves looks like. If you're wondering why I'm not showing both of the sleeves, guys, it's because I don't want this video to be too long that's why i'm only showing one if they have more than one and it is just printed on black vinyl okay i don't know why they didn't do this as a gatefold i would have made it easier 
This vinyl is really heavy. Except it has got two records in. There we go. So next I have Shawn Mendes Handwritten. Which is not in a sleeve. It's just printed on blue vinyl. I don't know why that's not in a sleeve. Then I have Shawn Mendes um, self-titled. So, and again, this doesn't have a sleeve either. I don't really know what's going on. They, they both came like that, so I got these two at the same time. And this is black vinyl. Then I have Little Mix LM5. for this it just has LM5 on this side and just credits on this side and I'm pretty sure this is yep standard black vinyl now I can't get it back in Then we have the Vamps Night and Day Day Edition in vinyl, which I'm pretty sure this has multiple. I think I've got a sign. No, I didn't. I didn't get signed in there. Right, and again, this has two um, sleeves. I'm just going to show one through the lyrics on that side and the track listing for if it wants to focus, which it clearly doesn't. And again, this is black vinyl. So then we have Five Seconds of Summer Young Blood on vinyl. And that's a code sticking out there. I'm pretty sure it was. That's what the sleeve looks like. So it has a hand on that side and wow you literally can't see anything it's credits on this side yeah credits that's it and this is printed on light blue vinyl which i'm pretty sure it must be the lighting in this room because it doesn't oh there you go okay you can see that just took a minute all right and again this has a code to get um free download of the album but I have Apple Music so I stream their music all the time anyway and now it doesn't want to doesn't want to go back in because of the code there we go There's the code if anyone wants it. I don't know if you, you literally can't see that. There you go. If you want a free copy, free download of Five Seconds Summer Youngblood, there's the code. Because I'm never going to use it. Right. Nearly done, guys. Nearly there. Okay, so next I have Nile Horan Flicker, which this is a gatefold and it just has it just looks like that it's a gatefold but it only has one vinyl i don't get that all right so this is what the sleeve looks like it has that on one side with thank yous and then lyrics on that side and this is printed on standard black vinyl Alright, and then I have Night and Day Night Edition sign, I don't know if you can really see that. I mean, you can up there. It is signed. Yeah, you can see that. Yeah. So, this, this also comes with a poster, but again, I'm not going to show that. It's what the sleeve looks like. It has that on one side. And credits are... 
yeah, credits on that side. And this is standard black vinyl. You can't see that. Sorry about the reflection of my camera, by the way. It reflects on the vinyl when it hits the light, I guess. Alright, so then we have Little Mix Glory Days, which I actually found out from another YouTuber that this pressing of this version of their album is actually a UK exclusive, and I didn't know that. So that's what the sleeve looks like. It has this really cool collage on this side and lyrics on that side and it's printed on clear pink like, like literally i'm looking through a pink vinyl right now you can't yeah so i feel kind of special that we got a bright highlighter pink version of the or pressing of this album. Oops, there we go. Okay, so this next one is really special for me. It is Five Seconds of Summer, their self titled album on picture disc. So it has it's them on one side and doodles on that side. And this is really special because I bought this off of ebay for really cheap and i've seen this going for hundreds of pounds so i consider myself i mean it says there it's going to focus it's there special edition so to have this i feel really lucky so the next one is one direction four and this again is a gatefold it's going to be really hard to show there you go. Alright, again, this is two um, two things in one, which I feel kind of bad for not showing both of them because they have pictures on, but we have that picture on one side and that picture on the other side. And it's just on standard black vinyl. Right, and then we, I have one, two, three, four more to go, guys. We're nearly there. Right, then I have Harry Styles' uh, self-titled album. And again, this is a gatefold, so it just looks like that. So it's just a book in there. And the sleeve just looks like this. And again, it's standard black vinyl. A lot of these are just normal pressings. I don't have loads of different special editions and yeah. I hate these. I hate those kind of sleeves. It's just so hard to get back in. So then we have One Direction Made in the AM. Which, oh, I thought it was a gatefold. It's not. It's just got two um, vinyls inside it. So we have that on one side. And we have a thank you on that side. And again, it's just on black vinyl. Alright, two more to go, guys. We're nearly there. And I get to sit and edit this. I'm doing a cassette collection next week, by the way, guys. So the second to last one is Zayn Malik, Mind of Mine. If you're wondering why I don't have Icarus Falls on vinyl or his... I think he released a side one? Yeah, he did. Um, if you're wondering why I don't have those, it's because they weren't released on vinyl. They were just on CD, so that's why I just have one. And this is also a gatefold, which just looks like that. And I'm pretty sure 
last I checked, I'm pretty sure this is on like a bright green vinyl. So there's the slip cover thing. Okay, it's not, probably not picking up on camera. How, there you go. You can see that. So it's not clear. Well, it's, it's semi-clear. I can kind of see through that, but it's more like a, well, you, you just saw it's like a bright green vinyl. And my last and very first vinyl that I ever got, actually no, no, my second vinyl that I ever got, my first one was um, Midnight Memories Picture Disc by One Day. My second vinyl ever was Sounds Good, Feels Good by Five Seconds of Summer. This is not a gatefold, and I think this is, yeah, it's just standard black vinyl, but the sleeve has lyrics on that side and the boys on that side so that was part two of my vinyl collection i'm sorry it's taken me so long but i hope you guys can understand i have been waiting for multiple things and now those things have all come together it's all worked out so i will see you guys in my next video which will most likely be my cassette collection thanks for watching guys don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Follow me on Instagram and Twitter, which I will link down below. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys!